cipher of deceit. In the heart of the bustling metropolis, where skyscrapers touched the clouds and the city lights never dimmed, there existed a world hidden from the naked eye. A world of secrets, lies, and a cipher of deceit that wove through the fabric of society. The city's elite, draped in suits and silken gowns, navigated a labyrinth of power, fueled by alliances and betrayals. At the center of this clandestine world was Adrian Kane, a charismatic and enigmatic figure known for his ability to decipher the intricate codes of deception that threaded through the city's power circles. Adrian's sharp mind and keen intuition made him both feared and respected. His reputation as a master of the cipher of deceit preceded him, casting a shadow over those who dared to cross his path. One chilly evening, as the city lights glittered like distant stars, a mysterious figure approached Adrian with a proposition. The stranger, clad in shadows and whispers, handed him an encrypted message that spoke of a conspiracy that could shake the very foundations of the city. Adrian, always hungry for a challenge, accepted the task. The cipher before him was unlike anything he had encountered. Its intricate patterns danced before his eyes, teasing him with hidden meanings and encrypted truths. As he delved into the labyrinth of symbols, he sensed the gravity of the conspiracy that lay beneath. The message led Adrian to a hidden society, a group of powerful individuals who operated in the shadows, manipulating the city's fate for their own gain. Their motives were obscured by layers of deceit, and their actions threatened to plunge the metropolis into chaos. Adrian's investigation took him to the upper echelons of society, where the elite danced on the precipice of power and betrayal. Each step he took unraveled a new layer of the conspiracy, revealing a web of lies that ensnared politicians, business magnates, and even law enforcement. The cipher of deceit was complex, and its threads wove through every corner of the city. As he delved deeper, Adrian found himself entangled in a dangerous game of cat and mouse. The more he uncovered, the more he realized that his pursuit of the truth had made him a target. The shadows that once served as his allies now seemed to close in, threatening to consume him. Adrian's journey brought him to a luxurious penthouse overlooking the city, where a clandestine meeting of the conspirators was set to take place. With the decrypted cipher in hand, he infiltrated the gathering, moving through the opulent crowd like a phantom. The conspirators, oblivious to the impending revelation, spoke in hushed tones about their plans to manipulate markets, control political landscapes, and amass wealth at the expense of the city's unsuspecting inhabitants. Adrian listened, gathering the final pieces of the puzzle that would expose the cipher of deceit. As the clock struck midnight, Adrian made his move. He confronted the conspirators with the decrypted message, revealing their secrets to the world. Chaos erupted in the penthouse as alliances shattered, and the once united cabal turned on each other. Adrian, a puppeteer of truth, watched as the city's foundations trembled under the weight of its own deceit. In the midst of the chaos, the mysterious figure who had delivered the encrypted message revealed themselves. It was Cassandra, a brilliant hacker with a vendetta against the conspirators. Her past intertwined with theirs, and the cipher of deceit had been her way of seeking justice for the shadows that haunted her. Together, Adrian and Cassandra orchestrated the downfall of the conspirators. The city, though scarred by the revelation, began the process of healing. The corrupted were exposed, and the citizens demanded accountability. The cipher of deceit, once a weapon used against the city, became a symbol of its redemption. Adrian, Having fulfilled his role as the city's cipher-breaker, retreated into the shadows. His work was done, and the metropolis would forever bear the scars of its hidden secrets. Cassandra, too, vanished into the digital abyss, leaving behind a legacy of justice and retribution. In the aftermath, the city underwent a transformation. New leaders emerged, committed to transparency and accountability. The once impenetrable fortress of deceit crumbled, and a new era dawned. As for Adrian, he became a legend, a name whispered in the dark corners of the city, a symbol of the power of truth against the cipher of deceit. His legacy lived on, a reminder that even in the shadows, light could prevail. And so, the metropolis, scarred but resilient, moved forward, leaving behind the labyrinth of lies that once threatened to consume it. The cipher of deceit, 
once an insidious force, was now a tale told in hushed tones, a cautionary story for those who dared to dance on the edge of shadows.